guys are having an absolutely wonderful, wonderful day. Um, got my three girls, three of my girls here with me, and um, we the other day had actually had enjoyed a great um, outing together where um, I took them outside and, um, and everything. And I'll post a few pictures of them outside kind of enjoying <laughs> enjoying the sunshine yesterday um but yeah but we had a great time and as you can see <laughs> they um i had them in their little she's got her princess crown and they're both h's this is little hey oh let me get it right <laughs> um i like that oh mother but the who lived in the shoe and had so many kids she didn't know what to do when I'm trying to remember the names. Okay, so hey we Haley and Hayden. Yes, I think I got it right. Haley and Hayden. Okay. And of course, Isabella. Say yeah, hi. Hello. So, anyways, hanging with my three girls. Now that I've got the names correct <laughs> um, and everything, but I um, just had a lot of fun. And it just kind of brought me to mind of a, a question I was asked was um, Do I prefer boys or girls? Um, and I guess you could say I really had to just go back and take a look at my babies and all the different dolls that I collect and just try to decide, you know, what, what actually do I see the most of. And when I was thinking about it and counting up how many boys versus how many girls I have, I had way more girls than I do boys. And um, so it just kind of made me think about why why do I gravitate? It seems so I gravitate more towards the girls um, than the boys. And I don't know. I think the thing for me is, you know, little things like this and <laughs> like this. This is so much fun. And the little bows and just the, the, the cute clothing and attire, I guess. I don't know. And the fact that you get to style their hair and, I don't know, ponytails and do different things. Um, maybe that's part of the appeal of having a girl versus a boy. Um, I don't know. Just something about it. I think I love the dresses and I love to dress them up. And um, Not that you can't dress up a boy, but... Excuse me. Let's see here. Let's see. Not that you can't dress up a boy, but I guess it, it just seems like there's so many accessory choices. I mean, you could have, you know, necklaces. Um, I put the necklaces on them, and I have little bracelets on her little hands. Yeah, my gloves on today because it was pretty cold. And I don't know. It's just, I just feel like I can do so much with that. Um, and maybe that's part of the appeal. But, um... Yeah, so I think that's a big a big deal for me is being able to do the dress up and the, the cute cuteness of them. Now things have come a long way. I mean, I go into the boy department now and I see cute stuff that the boys have, and I'm like, oh my goodness, that's adorable. I especially love the little shirts that they have for boys that have my little monster on them written on them. I think it's so adorable to see a little boy wearing. My Little Monster t-shirt or shirt. I think it's too cute. But so they, they do make some great clothes now for boys. I mean, so it's just as great of a selection for boys as it's girls. So I don't know. I, I, I you know, I, I don't know why I seem to gravitate towards having girls. And so a lot of people were saying was, wow, you got all these girls and it's girls. And I was like, wow, I really do um, have more girls. Oh, sorry. Oh. Ah! They're showing them my bad hair. She's having a bad hair day. And that's why this covers a multitude of sins. <laughs> yeah, I'm having a bad day, hair day. Mommy could just put something cute on it and we keep it moving. So yeah, so i um, very curious to know if you have more girl dolls versus boy dolls. And have you noticed that you have a preference for boy dolls versus girl dolls? Be really curious to hear your responses. So please um, 
comment below. Let me know if you have more girls versus boys and why. And like the video and of course subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. But yeah, but just a really interesting observation. Oh, wanted to take a second. So everybody has their cute outfits on. I don't know. Let's see if you can see her. Icky, I'm holding my doll. Mommy, you're going to make me get up and show them like what I'm wearing? Like, really? So she's actually Miss... Oh my god, I keep calling... I want to call... Miss Haley. Ah. <laughs> this is why I have too many H's in my family. But these are her little cute shoes she was wearing today. She's a big, tall girl, so I'm trying to show you her. Keep her in the camera frame here. But, um... <laughs> okay, she settles back in. Yeah, so she was just like this. She had her little cute pink gloves on and she's wearing her cute princess crown. Sit her back here. Oh no! Don't leave me out! And this is uh, Haley. Haley, you've lost your. My goodness. Do you know, like I have a, a mini four or something going on, Mom? What happened? So, and I just left her hair down. I had it in ponytails, and then I just decided to just let her be. But she's wearing, let's show them what you're wearing. She has her little gloves on. She's heavier. I'm trying to keep her in the frame. But uh, she's really big. As you can see here. Let's see. And chunky. She's really heavy, so I couldn't like hold her up too long. <laughs> See, I can't hold you up too long before mommy's arms start to hurt. But yeah, so she's adorable. And you know, I love these little things. Um, I'm thinking to buy some more and have them as little cute giveaway gifts. Let me know what you guys think if you'd be interested in me buying some more of these and having them as free giveaways um you know little free giveaway contests but these i think they're so adorable so i can let me know what you think about that but um they're cute on them isn't that cute but again i don't know she, she's so big oh boy she's all she's loosey-goosey but this is what she's wearing oh, i was trying to show you her She's so heavy. Her little shoes. She's got these cute little moccasin type shoes on. She's just like, look, I'm not going to cooperate with you. I refuse to. I'm just too big for this. She's too cute. And I love it. her head turns. All of their heads, with well, these three, all of their other heads will turn. And so there you go. Back in. All right. So let's kind of sit her here. And, uh, yeah. Pull this down. They're so heavy that that's what she's like. No, no, mommy. But last but not least, after that crazy struggle that we all bore witness to because she didn't want to, this is the dress that I have gotten for Isabella. And the, this lighting, excuse my lighting, is horrible. But it's actually a white dress with puffed sleeves, which I love because it covers part of her arm there. And um, and I got these little white little shoes to go with. But it's yellow. It's a yellow dress, and I would never thought that would look good on her, but it really does. And it has like organdy. I don't know if you can see that in green all over it, and then it has like layers. There's another layer, see? Like three layers, three or four layers of just pure beauty. Come here. Let's put that Pessy back. She's our Princess Pessy. And, um, but yeah, and then of course I've got the little headband. Remember what I said about headbands? They cover a multitude of sins. So if your baby doesn't have um, a lot of hair, like my Isabella, um, oftentimes 
I can detract uh, <laughs> from the lack of hair with one of the lovely headbands. So, oops, I'm sorry, I'm trying to focus in. Yeah, so there she is. Say hi, YouTube community. And again, this is probably washing out not only her color, but washing out the dress as well. But the little legs. See, my little legs are still stuffed out because mommy still needs to put me into a different diaper. <laughs> but this headband, like I said, it, she has very thinly rooted hair. You guys probably saw in my other video. But it helps cover it. Cover it, so. But she's just precious. See, even though... I don't have a whole lot of hair, mommy. Mommy still loves me. And you may be able to get a better, I'm trying to bring her back so you can get a better view of the dress and how pretty it is. Yeah, my dress is just gorgeous, mommy. But yeah, so anyways, I had the three girls out yesterday and um, just had a good time with them. But yeah, um, as I said, just comment below. Let me know if you prefer girls over boys and why. Do you have more girls? them boys all right and you guys have a wonderful wonderful day and oh also hopefully everyone is um sticking with the sorry i'm trying to reposition this thing is going wild hopefully everyone also is sticking to their new year's resolutions i don't know if you guys are i'm sorry i'm just trying to get this thing to work here it's not. Sorry, I'm kind of wobbly wobbling it. Um, but yeah, I actually have surprised myself with this year for the first time in, oh my goodness, I would say forever. I have actually been following, let's see here, my New Year's resolutions. So, so yeah, so sorry about all the moving around of the camera. I was trying to get it more in focus. But yeah, so just um, also let me know if you're keeping up with your New Year's resolutions. So um, you guys take care and make it a wonderful, wonderful day. And thanks so much for joining me and the girls. <laughs> all right. Mm, bye.